This is Amy Chan from CakeDecoratingSchool.com, and if you like cake decorating, you're in the right place. If you're interested in these products, check the links in the description. In this video, we're making waffles for our mini waffle maker, so let's get started. I have two eggs that I've separated, I've whipped my whites, and I've got my little yolks in a bowl. I'm going to break them up, add in a cup of milk, and four tablespoons of melted butter. And I've got my liquids ready and I can set them aside. I'm gonna pull over my bowl with my dry ingredients and I've got one cup plus two tablespoons of all-purpose flour and to that I'm going to add a few things. One and a half tablespoons of sugar, a quarter teaspoon of salt, and we have one and a half teaspoons of baking powder. I'm gonna sift this all together really quickly. Beautiful. And our dries are ready to go. We can mix in our wet ingredients. With just a quick stir and then we're going to fold in our whites and waffles are great because you can add a lot of things and that is up to you so whether it's half a teaspoon of vanilla extract some lemon zest a little cinnamon or nutmeg you can make them all sorts of flavors so once that batter is ready to go we're gonna just gently fold in our whites a nice little third at a time. You don't wanna fold in all of it all at once because you'll deflate them. And this will give your waffles a nice fluffy texture. So we wanna be really gentle as we fold in those whites. So we are ready to make some little waffles with our mini waffle maker. We plugged it in and the indicator light just went off and it's nice and warm, right? So the unit heats up pretty quickly. I was fairly nicely surprised. So we just wanna give it a nice little spray and then use something with a nice pour spout to pour your waffle batter in, right? I'm gonna try and get nice coverage without it being too much because you don't wanna overfill them. And we are going to shut this and see what comes out. All right, our little waffle's been cooking in the waffle maker, so we're just gonna use the tab in front to open up. The color looks beautiful. You can't always shut it again if it's still a little too light, and you wanna use something wooden to get it out. If you use something metal, you can potentially damage your little cooking surface. So you can just see that's a beautiful little waffle. Ooh, it's really nice and hot. I'm gonna keep going, and we're gonna make ourselves a pile of waffles. So it's all done and we had a great time and a really easy time making our little mini waffle treats with our Dash Mini Waffle Maker. They baked up really easy and really quickly, so it's a really awesome buy. If you enjoyed this video and you'd like more about the cake decorating materials and equipment we use, or just some inspirational videos about cake decorating itself, you can follow us on Insta or YouTube at Cake Decorating School. If you'd like to know more about yearly membership and what it entails, you can go to www.cakedecoratingschool.com for more information. And if you're interested in these products, you can check the links in the description.